ourselves far too frequently as just individuals, separated from one another. Whereas you are connected, and what you do affects the whole world. <laughs> Let me begin by thanking uh, Premier Stelmack and Maurice Stelmack for taking the time out of their busy schedules for being and joining us here today. Ladies and gentlemen, Premier Stelmack and Maurice Stelmack. Also, I would like to thank Edmonton Ellerslie PC Association and Edmonton Gold Bar PC Association who helped organize this wonderful evening. As you all know, we're in the worst recession in the last 50 years. And under Premier's leadership, he has worked so diligently, his thoughtfulness and his vision for the province, as he always says, let's put some money aside, $17 billion in a sustainability fund, as he would always say, it. In, in, uh, when times are good, let some money put, money, put some money aside in a sock, and he's done exactly that in a bank, $17 billion, that's one heck of a big sock to have $17 billion in, so that is exactly what our premier has done. So without a further ado, I would like to invite Honorable Premier Stalmack for his remarks. Thank you very much. I do want to thank each and every one of you for joining us here tonight. It looks like a full house, and I'm so pleased that uh, so many of uh, the Russia's colleagues are in attendance and also uh, so many friends of the Alberta Progressive Conservative Party that uh, working uh, jointly in the constituencies of Goldbar and Ellerslie, uh, joining together on this uh, fundraiser. I believe that uh, it is of critical importance that we all work together to sure, make sure that all constituencies are supported between elections, uh, particularly those constituencies like Goldbar, and I commit to you, we're going to win it next time. So don't uh, ever give up because uh, we'll continue to grow, we'll continue to prosper, and we'll continue to be a province of opportunity and a province of hope. Thank you so very, very much. Saskatchewan, British Columbia and Alberta working together streamlining regulations, removing those costs to doing business. We're finally going to have the same transportation rules, the same width of the trailer, same length of the trailer. And can you imagine trying to load product from Saskatchewan, trying to get it to British Columbia, or even from Alberta to British Columbia? Different weights. We always load to the commonest denominator. Well, if you do that, guess what happens? To every unit, Whatever unit you're hauling on the trailer costs you more. So how are we going to compete under those circumstances? We can no longer do that. And perhaps, maybe, live long enough that it will see one license plate. One license plate for a commercial truck, and I don't care if you buy it in Vancouver, Edmonton, or Regina. For the intermediate section you have provided to us, actually a lot of us came to understand what the government has to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. We thank you for that. Now, just before co concluding the meeting this evening, I'd like to welcome our uh, Edmund and Ellerslie Treasurer, Rama Ivory, to come and say a word of thanks. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and very special evening to our most welcome guests. First of all, I would like to take this opportunity to thank our Mr. Premier to being with us and taking his time out of his busy schedule to be part of the, this gathering. So just to close, I also want to thank all of you for your support and uh, what that means to us. As you know, the, the, the fundraising is a big part of politics and uh, we welcome and we, we are honored by your support. 